What's up, guys? It's Kitty and Cat, and welcome back to some more Pokemon uh, Colosseum map being the game. Uh, last episode, we took out members one to nine of this dubious, um, what should we call you, series of bad guys, I suppose, villains, peons, more likely. Uh, and then we were going to take on the final guy. I might need to actually go get some balls. Yeah, I'm gonna go buy some balls before we do this. Uh, yeah, we took out uh, members one to nine of this long line of bad guys, and we had just the last guy. Uh, who we've heard is named Dakim. Uh, that's all we know about him. Uh, well, we kind of know that he's a bit of a hard ass boss and kind of scary, but nothing overly informational about who he is. Uh, maybe that he's a bit stronger than everyone else. So we're gonna face him today. I do plan on catching the Shadow Bug one he must have, because if he's a boss guy, he's gonna need to. Gonna need to know who uh, is gonna need to have a Shadow Bug one because it's slightly stronger, just like Myra B did. Uh, so, we're gonna buy some. Hook rules. Uh, some great balls and some ultra balls. Uh, from bug type, but I'm with both mine. And we might as well grab a bit expensive, some timer balls in case this battle drags on a little bit. And we'll sell that premier ball. So we did just spend 35,000 on just pulls, uh, but we might need them if we are unlucky or whatever. Uh, we have been Fairly lucky up to a point so far, so maybe it won't be too bad, but you never know until you try it. Uh, <clears throat> Alright, so now let's make our way back up there uh, and face this guy. Uh, I should actually mention. You see on the side of the screen, levels don't match between this episode and last episode because I did some grinding uh, between episodes. So yeah, everyone's slightly stronger. Um, I don't think anyone knows any new moves. I have off the top of my head, I can't remember, but it was a week ago I did the grinding. I was going to do it a bit more, but I think I don't want to be too much stronger. So we're going to stay as is. Uh, also, no evolutions happened yet, but one may be on the horizon. But let's have a look. Fine, after all the persuading I did, you still won't hand it over? Hmm, <laughs> this is what happens when stubborn oaths who, who... This is what happens to stubborn oaths who don't do what I say. Oh, ouch, you, you treacherous swine. How could you refuse to battle? Dahaha, <laughs> treacherous! You don't, you don't, didn't think that really, you didn't really think that that a worm, a worm, bloody hell, I cannot read. You really, you didn't really think a worm like you could win. All you had to do was hand over the time flute without making a fuss. It's your own fault for getting hurt. Since you're not cooperating, I don't have any choice but to haul you off to Iron's lab. Hey dude, bloody hell, hello. Hmm? Who are you? Well, what were my underlings doing? Losing. Now, for an outfit I bought yours. 
You must be the troublemaker who messed with Scrub in Celebi's forest. Yeah, he still has a funny name. Now you have come to mess with me, the great ducking. Don't make me laugh. I'll pound a lesson into your flesh and bones so you'll never even think of bothering me again. So this is Cypher Admin Dakim. He looks funny. With a Metang and a Gulem. Steel, I think. I feel like I made the good choice to with who to start with, with Sponge and uh Solon. Uh so no new moves here. Oh, Mudshot! I don't know if I've got that last episode or between episodes. But I swapped it for Reflect whenever we got it. Oh, you lucky sod. You made the good choice there. I, I, either way, that mechanic took a bloody beat in this right now. Huh. Uh oh. You're okay. You're just a beefcake, you didn't even think about it when it hit. And I think I like it there. Um I should I return? I really thought Psychic was way to go. So you're faster than both of them, but is this your strategy? Just like alternate earthquake and protect? Oh, now that one's a bit stronger. I don't actually know the level difference between those two. Uh, but yeah, let's, let's. Yeah, let's bring out Philo. See, I didn't want to bring out Philo because it's got the EXP share on. I wanted it to get low levels, but. Might be the best choice. Yeah, that golem is going down though. Oh, very near it. That's a flame wheel, Matang, and you surf. We're alternating bloody earthquake and protect, aren't you? Are you can use earthquake. No, you're using psychic. I'm kind of worried. Damn it! Sponge with my trump card and just passed it. This is going so well, so quickly. Uh. Hmm. Go on, Noctor. You next. Saving Luna, Luma for. So. Flame wheel on you. Still on you. Well, now you're using protect. Stop alternating protect. You would be dead right now. You bastard. Alright, either way, that golem is down. I'm really annoyed about uh, Sponge. Sponge was E1. You got most of the XP there, but Marsh Tom. Grass types. Uh, let's hang die. Use fly. I think I need a grass type move. Um, the camera up. Live, live, yes. I'm gonna take your turn. I'm not gonna use dig because earthquake will just knock it out. Do I have vibes? Super potion. Oh, bastard. Revives. I 
playing well on you. <sighs> this is going badly. The nice thing is, you only need ground type moves. Uh, not all, which is good. So, I mean, no mud shot, no earthquake. Water and fire type moves can get you. And then you're next. Uh. Huh. That was easy. I really need to take out this camera up. Because Bloody Ente is the last Pokemon in his repertoire. And it is the Shadow Pokemon we have, oh, I have been working towards. I uh, don't know how, how long you've had Faint Attack either, that may have been another new move. I actually don't remember any of this. Shadow Rush. I'm worried about this camera and this bloody earthquake because it can do a shit ton of damage to Ente, which may mean make sure you bring it out. So I want to take care of it as quickly as possible. Here comes the earthquake. But I'm worried about how much damage does it do? A lot. Paralysis may be good right now, that's it protective. Only you weren't slow, Lunan. What do I want to do? Take down. Fire blast. Fuck's sake. Alright, Lunan, your turn. Please, dear lord, don't use Earthquake again, you bastard. Or just die, that was good. Yes, well done Noctul, yes, well done. Oh, you need a level. That is a level. Well done Noctul. You need to use Thunder Wave. You still win. Now nah, I'm worried. Damn it. A still win could knock it out. Don't kill it, Noctul. That's good. Right, get off the Thunder Wave. Get off the Thunder Wave. Just yes. Yes. This is good. This is good. This is good. And now, this is why I chuck balls. And hope to high hell it doesn't shadow rush itself to death or shadow rush me to death. I'm gonna take this time to just get up and knock for the safe measures. Alright, now this is a snag ultra ball, so a single ball would be very, very good right now. But it is a legendary, which means that's likely to happen a lot. And turn the legendary. Deep bastard. Shadow rush again. And now it's a one on one. I don't know how many times I've been playing this. I've been going doing this battle for we may be reaching an awful time to use timer balls. That's gonna happen a lot. I'm worried it's either gonna take itself out or take Luma out, because Luma is not the most defensive of both. If it can get a hit off on Luma. Paralysis isn't really paralysis isn't really affecting it all that much. 
it's still hitting very well. One, two, -ish. not even two. There it is, it's the paralysis that I just mentioned wasn't working. The only thing that would be better than paralysis would be, I think, sleep or freeze, maybe? But it's because they're temporary and can be broken out of quite quickly. One. You're not playing ball today, are you, Ente? Fire blast. Oh no, now worried. Don't kill it on one hit. Don't kill it on one hit. Okay, I've got one more hit in me. Or even less. Come on. Get in the ball and stay in the ball. Get in the ball and stay in the ball. This is gonna potentially take multiple tries. One, two. Damn it. Come on, Ente. Just stay in the ball. Should I rush? You're not gonna survive this, are you? Nope. Bastard. Oh, that was a stalemate. I think I lose a stalemate. Pretty sure I lose a stalemate. Yeah. Also. Oh, it took me all the way back here. Did it take me back to a save point? No. Alright, I'm gonna send you out to the front. Alright, we're gonna... I'm gonna try that again. Uh, and this, and I'm gonna stop by. Uh, I think Agate might have some. I'm gonna check here first. But I'm gonna get some revives. Maybe some more healing items. You got revives in here, mate? Revives. There's revives. I can get four, five. Yep, yeah. that's all I can afford. Not five each of those. I am literally out of money now because I just lost half of it to that Dakin guy. First battle ended in a stalemate. What a bastard. Alright. <clears throat> Let's try this climb again. Actually gonna just for prosperity heal here so that if I lose I am sent back here rather than having to do all the traveling again so now all these these all these shadow Pokemon we do have a second chance to catch them I think some of them even have a third chance but I do want to catch Pokemon like Entei on their first go because they are going to be a pain to fight for a second time. Right, so back up to the top. <laughs> 